When packing for a trip, sometimes it might seem easier to pack things in a check bag rather than in a carry-on, but I'm here to tell you that there are certain items that are either prohibited by the TSA or that you should never pack in a check bag, no matter how convenient it may seem. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you 10 things that you should never pack in a check bag. Let's go. Dream vacations start here. Hey, it's Ben with Ben Tennis Dream Vacations, helping you plan for your next trip or vacation. Let's get into the first item never to pack in your check bag, and that would be your laptop and other electronics. Now, you may not want to carry your laptop or certain electronics in your carry-on, but the truth is, check bags are handled pretty roughly, and I would think the last thing you'd want to see is to open up your bag and see a damaged laptop, a camera, or any other valuable electronic. So to avoid this, keep these items packed in your carry-on to make sure they stay safe. Now, there is a TSA rule about electronics containing lithium batteries. These would be your laptops, your smartphones, your cameras and tablets. If you decide you want to pack those in your check bags, you can do so. As long as the lithium batteries inside those devices remain in those devices and the devices themselves are completely turned off. Now if you want to take spare uninstalled lithium batteries you can do so but you would not be able to pack those in your check bag. They would have to go in your carry-on bag per TSA rules. Just make sure that the batteries are not damaged in any way because if they are they would not be allowed on board an aircraft. Moving on to number two, do not pack jewelry or anything else very valuable to you in a check bag. On average, airlines lose around two bags for every thousand passengers. So while the likelihood of the airline you're flying on losing your bag is rather low, do you really want to take the chance of losing something really valuable to you? Unfortunately, theft also does occur, and while you can get a TSA-approved lock for your luggage, it would only slow down a potential thief and not actually stop the theft from actually occurring. So if you're traveling with something really valuable like family jewelry or a special souvenir you picked up at the destination you were just at, Give yourself peace of mind and keep those items in your carry-on bag. The number three thing not to pack in your check bag would be important documents. If you're one who likes to print out your travel itinerary and other important information, then you definitely don't want to pack those in your check bag in the event your bag is lost or delayed. In most cases, airlines are more likely to delay getting your bag back to you than to lose it. But in either case, if you ended up packing your travel itinerary and other important information in your check bag, then you might be out of luck. And to go along with that, the number four thing you should never pack in your check bag is cash and credit cards. Now it's smart not to keep all your cash and credit cards in one place, but your check bag should never be one of those places. As I said before, delays, lost baggage, and theft can occur, and you definitely don't want to be in a position where you can't pay for anything because you decided to keep your cash and credit cards in your check bag to keep them safe. If you're traveling with other people, have them carry some of the cash or one of the credit cards, or you can pick up a travel pouch like this one that you can wear around your neck, inside your clothes, or even a money belt to help spread your cash and credit cards around. If you're interested in picking up a travel pouch like this one, I'll link a product like this in the video description for you to check out. The number five thing not to pack in your check bag would be lighters, matches, and other flammable items. If you're planning on going on a camping trip, these are items that you might want to pack in your check bag, but for the most part, they are prohibited. You can't pack lighters without the fuel in them in a check bag. Otherwise, you are able to carry them in a carry-on bag as long as they are disposable or Zippo type lighters. Moving on to number six is not packing all your clothes in your check bag. If you find out when you get off the plane that your luggage has disappeared into the black hole of missing check bags, then you'd be grateful that you packed an extra change of clothes in your carry-on just in case the airline loses or delays your bag. I would also pack some toiletries in your carry-on as well, just so you can at least be able to brush your teeth and maybe even put on some deodorant if you needed to. The number seven thing not to pack in your check bag would be prescription medication. The last thing you want to have happen is not having your medication when you need it the most. If you have prescription medication, make sure you take those with you in your carry-on. You are allowed to exceed the 3.4 ounce rule for these type of medications, but you'll need to tell the TSA agent that you have them so they can properly screen the medication. It does help if you have your medication labeled as well as a doctor's note or medical ID, but it is not required. Number eight thing not to pack in your check bag would be breakable items like wine and other glass alcohol containers. I'm sure the last thing you wanna see is broken glass and wine all over the inside of your suitcase. Baggage handlers have been known to bust up a prize possession or two, but just know that they are constantly under pressure to load hundreds of bags in a short amount of time and are just trying to get your flight off the runway. And sometimes this requires a good throwing arm. If you want to keep these breakable items safe, I would suggest picking up a dedicated wine bag to help protect the contents of your bag in case any bottles break. I'll link to some options for you in the show notes, so check those out if you're interested. Number nine thing not to pack in your check bag is food and drinks. You're not prohibited from packing these items in your check bag, but it's a good idea not to. Bottle drinks may crack or explode, ruining the clothes inside your suitcase. And if your flight gets delayed or your bag gets lost for a while, the food you packed inside them may spoil. Also, if you're traveling internationally, you're not allowed to bring certain foods into that country, so it's really best not to pack food and drinks altogether in your checked bag. 
And lastly, for number 10, you might have a lot of questions about what you can and cannot bring through airport security. So I'm actually gonna point you to another video I made on the top 25 airport security questions answered. Not only do I think that'll help answer some of the questions you have, but also help you pack for your next trip. So be sure to check that video out. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to like the video and consider subscribing to get more travel related videos just like this one. Thank you so much for watching and hope to see you in a future video. Thank you.